You know, we're just days away from Christmas and you can definitely feel the spirit all over our area. Well, tonight, WMAR 2 News Aaron McPherson takes us to Aberdeen, where one family's faith was restored thanks to a local police officer. Another decorated home for the holidays, but these Christmas lights have a special meaning donated by Aberdeen police officers. As a police officer, we see people at the worst moments of their life, every call that we have. So if we can do something small like this, just to kind of restore hope, that's what it's about. Officer Cynthia Mowry responded to a vandalism call at this home. Christmas decorations destroyed. At first I was uh, really upset. And then uh, as soon as my children saw it, you know, it made it 100 times worse. Richard Vincenti has two boys, six and two. Officer Mowry just couldn't shake their look of disappointment that night. I was still thinking about it when I woke up the next morning, and that's when I knew. So she bought new decorations. Other officers pitched in, and they all put them up. I wanted the boys to wake up the next day and maybe have their faith restored, maybe have mom and dad's faith restored that there is good in the world. That's exactly what she did. I mean, I couldn't believe it that somebody's going to go out of their way and do that. I mean, they really didn't have to. Um, we appreciate it so much. A surprise for the boys that brought them so much joy. They love the dog. They love the elf. Um, I want to say the dog's probably the favorite. <laughs> the dog's my Yeah, favorite. everybody's favorite. <laughs> Officer Mowry tells us she was just doing her job and believes anyone else would have done the same. When I end my career, my goal is if one person can come forward and say, I remember when this police officer made an impact in my life, then I've done my job. In Aberdeen, Aaron McPherson, WMAR, 2 News. Now, while the family's grateful for Officer Mowry, they'll be happy when someone gets arrested. Police haven't been able to track down the people who vandalized the Vincentes Christmas decorations.